Despite the one in a million or hundreds of millions of chances, most of us are still hoping that maybe, just maybe, luck will finally be on our side. Winning the lottery is such a close to impossible feat that the odds of getting struck by lightning is higher. Nevertheless, we're still out here hoping and praying our lucky numbers get chosen. Want to know the secrets of a former lottery winner? Stick with us because we'll tell you the tips and tricks of 7-time lottery winner Richard Lustig and how to win the lottery. Hey guys, welcome to the Snapshot Bliss Luxury Channel, where we talk about amazing yachts, impressive planes, stunning watches, and so much more. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification so you're up to date every time we release new content like this one. Now let's get to it. Number 1. Buy more tickets One ticket is great and all, but multiple tickets increases your chances of winning because of its compounding effect. The only downside to this is you may need to spend more money initially, but if your goal is to win, the more tickets you buy increases your chances of winning and therefore increases your potential winnings too. Number 2. Don't choose consecutive numbers The likelihood of winning with consecutive numbers is so low, it's even lower than the chances of you winning the lottery itself. However, that doesn't mean it's impossible. Still, according to 7-time lottery winner Richard Lustig, it's best if you don't pick consecutive numbers. Number 3. It's best to pick randomly and not create patterns. Don't forget that each number has the same probability of being chosen as the winning number. There is no program that can accurately predict the winning number in a lottery, but if you select a less popular number, you have a better chance of avoiding sharing the prize. There is a strong possibility that you could lose a chance to win because you are spending too much time trying to figure out a numerical pattern. Lotteries draw from a wide variety of numbers, therefore the winning ticket is unlikely to have any patterns in the numbers. Number 4. Remember to stay in range. Research suggests that 70% of lottery jackpots have a sum of 104 to 176. This means that you have a higher chance of winning if the total of your chosen numbers are equal to the range 104 to 176. So avoid choosing extremely low numbers that may not reach 104 or extremely high numbers that surpasses 176. Number 5. Form a lottery pool. You can organize a group in your community, whether it be at your workplace, school, or anywhere you can find people who also want to play the lottery. With forming a lottery pool, you can all agree to play as a group and if someone wins, the prize money is split to all the members. This increases your chances of winning, but keep in mind that you'll have to share if ever you won. But this isn't much of a worry, especially with mega jackpots. Let's say your group of 10 won a billion dollars. You still have 100 million each to bag. That's not bad at all. Number 6. Make sure you're playing the right games. If you have the funds for it, it's okay to join a variety of lottery games simultaneously. When compared to a state or local lottery, the number pool is substantially larger if you play the national lottery draw. You must be present in person to win a local lottery, although the chances of winning are better than in the national lottery. Number 7. Try Quick Pick Tickets When you use Quick Pick, you have the benefit of saving time. For those who simply want to get in the game and have some hope of winning the jackpot, Quick Pick is the best method to do it quickly and easily. You don't have to spend time deciding the numbers to play or filling out a long form with hundreds of digits. Also, according to the figures, more lottery jackpots are won by quick pickers than by self-pickers. Statistics show that the quick pick option was utilized by almost 70% of lottery winners. Number 8. Look for unpopular games played at unusual times. Avoid playing in lottery games where there is always a winner and instead look at lesser known options. People are more inclined to participate in the lottery than you are, so your chances of winning are less likely. Choose a game that has fewer players, making your chances of winning much higher. The prize may be little compared to the mega jackpot ones, but the likelihood of winning is much better. Number 9. Avoid using birthdays as your chosen numbers. Choosing birthdays as your numbers increases the chances of you splitting the prize with many other participants. If you want less competition and to take home the whole prize money, it's best not to use numbers from 1 to 31. Although the probability of all numbers being chosen are all the same, this tip applies especially if you win with uncommon numbers. Number 10. Law of Attraction If you're not familiar with it or simply one of the skeptics, you might want to take note of this tip. Lots of lottery winners have given testaments to the effectiveness of manifestation to their success in the lottery. In fact, some of them have even been featured in books. Written by Eddie Coronado, he interviewed four lottery winners who admitted to using the power of their thoughts and feelings in winning. Learning to manifest abundance is one of the most powerful techniques you can apply not only in hitting the jackpot, but also in getting anything you want out of life. Most importantly, set a budget and stick to it if you decide to play the lotto. Never exceed it. 
It's not worth squandering your money on lottery tickets when you could be using some of it for necessities. What do you think of the recent $1.4 billion jackpot? And what would you do if you won the lottery? Comment down below. Also, if you're interested in more videos like these, make sure to let us know. And if you want to see more, just visit the channel. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.